Welcome back to Rodeo and Panda Suit. Today's the day we are going to be reacting to Star Trek, Short Trek, Season 2, Episode 6, Season Finale. Let's do it. If I look exactly the same as I did in the last video, it's because it's the same day. Because I'm going to get really busy really soon, so I'm not going to have a lot of time to do these. So we're going to see how this goes. Well, let's just get into it. Don't know what to expect. Looks like another shortish one, like eight minutes, including credits. Ooh. My name is Kima. My mom is an anti-grav ringer at the Utopia Planitia shipyard on Mars. <laughs> I wonder what species she is? I don't recognize her species. My name is Lil. My dad is a quality system supervisor this girl's at the Mars in facility. I know we've been through this a couple of times, but there's a lot going on here. I'm just not going to be able to make it home this year. I'm sorry. I'm disappointed too, sweetheart. I'm... Interesting. Star Trek for teens. <laughs> I, I wish I could swim. Like dolphins. Like Why are dolphins these so fucking sad? Like, honestly, I can't handle it. My hormones right now? Like, I can't do it. Will drive us away. I like this song, guys. Come on. Just for one day. Just for one day. Okay, sorry. I'm trying to arrange plans for gaming and it's just chaos. Are they going to be your best friends? They're going to become best friends, right? Damn it, now we're gonna cry. <laughs> Fuck. Oh no, Picard. I hate being right. 
children of the Mars. Well, uh, I just uh. all right. It's been an emotional day. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Um, for a finale, I don't know. Part of me kind of feels like some of these stories I feel like I've seen before. And I hate to say that, but like I called it, they're like, you know, enemies and then became friends. Obviously, like a traumatic event was going to or something that they had in common was going to uh, make them friends in the end. So, yeah, I, I don't know. I feel like I definitely really appreciate what they're doing with music in these two. I feel like they've done, I don't know what the scores for all of these shorts have been really good and epic. And I feel like it really affects like music has such an impact on a film and how it's going to affect your audience. And some people might not even like think about that. Like music might just be an afterthought for things, but it can actually really um make or break a film so i don't know if it's just because like i'm a little stressed out right now so i'm like not as focused or i don't know i feel like i wasn't the tar i just i don't know why but i feel like it wasn't really the target audience for the last two shorts like this one and the one before that so i feel like my reaction is less than you know what it normally is during these but it wasn't bad like i did not like it i just kind of feel like the whole i don't know angsty teen thing is like a thing and then like I really liked what they were did with the children's story one I just I don't know I think it's just because I feel like I've seen this before like not this exact thing like not that people were on you know stationed on Mars and Mars was attacked and all that but uh the same kind of concept like two people two young people who are you know don't like each other end up becoming friends because of either an event or something they hold in common something like that seems like a classic narrative so but that doesn't mean that it wasn't shot like that doesn't mean that it wasn't well done it was shot very nicely the music was great like it was still beautiful and still like moving and everything obviously like i, I you know welled up at the end there it was it was just because of the um uh, when she like angrily closed the phone on her dad or whatever so she didn't actually get to say goodbye she didn't have a nice moment with her father before he died so that's always like super sad i think that's like probably my biggest fear wow Let's not talk about death. It's been like a death-filled week. My butterfly died. Rest in peace, chick, the butterfly. Uh, regrets. I think that's always like, as <laughs> if anyone's ever held a single regret in their life, which I feel like is probably everybody, and if you don't, then there might be something wrong with you. This kind of narrative with that moment with the girl and her father on the phone um, can hit you in the feels. So yeah, definitely got me. What did you guys think as it for the season finale? Let me know how you feel. I'm just going to, I have nothing else to say. It's, I feel so weird right now. Like, I just feel like I must be stressed out or something because I feel like my mind's blank. Like, I have nothing to say. Anyway, let me know how you felt about that and whether you thought it was a good finale. And please give this video a thumbs up if you want to. Subscribe somewhere down there. And I guess just live long and prosper something.